Hi everybody, this is Guru Francis, Big Boy Screamador, and today's another sneak peek of what I'm going to be showcasing at the Big Boy Screamador Method to His Badness seminar in Olympia, Washington on September 25th. Stay tuned. Hi everybody, this is Guru Francis, Big Boy Screamador, and today I'm going to be doing another sneak peek of what we're going to be show what I'm going to be showcasing at the Big Boy Screamador's Method to His Madness seminar. But before I do that, I want to say thank, special thank you to our sponsors, uh, Mandocor, who makes the best um, best uh, uh, lightsabers or sabers uh, in the business. Let me show you one of them, right? So here's what, this is actually the FMA version of the lightsaber. It's, it's about the same length as the regular stick right here. So yeah, and check this out. Yes, so the, these are really, really cool. And of course, we want to say a special thank you to our other sponsor, Tack Knife. They make one of the best trainer swords, knives out there in the business. So visit them at tacknife.com. So today we're going to talk about the woo effect. What is the woo effect? It's W-O-O, weapons of opportunity. So I'm sorry. I know many Filipino martial artists are, might be upset with me on this one, but there's always that constant question, what if you don't have a stick? Well, the truth of the matter is we don't walk around with sticks all day long, right? We don't. We walk around, we just basically empty handed, right? One of these that I carry is one of these. This is called an Olight, right? And this is the Warrior Mini 2. This is something that just fits directly on my, on my non-dominant side. I'm right handed, so it's on my left side, right? Because that is, this is my tertiary weapon. And I'll show you guys the other, the other two in another time. But this is my tertiary or my third choice weapon or tool, okay? Now what I love about this is that not, it, it fits into mine like a kumbatan. So if you're a Filipino martial artist, you already know how to use this aspect of it, right? But the but one thing that you, a lot of people don't realize why a flashlight is so good is because it does this, right? It, it, this strobe light effect stuns your opponent, okay? So for example, I have here my, my student Jeremy to, to, uh, to, to, uh, to uh, practice with me to showcase this for you guys. So when he punches, I can parry out this way Check this way here and flash him right into the eyes. And in those split second of the disorientation that the light is giving to him, she could be enough enough time I need to completely, you know, take care of my, my opponent or run away. Whichever way, whichever is the most least chances you're gonna go to jail. Okay. So again, so if he punches, boom, flash him in the eye, he punches me the other side, boom, and I can use the, the actual flashlight as an as a impact weapon as well so this is one of the things that we're going to be talking about weapons of opportunity or what i like to call the woo effect until then don't forget to register for the seminar it's going to be september 25th 2021 from 12 to 6 p.m the website's right here so register at the early bird because the early bird you're going to get a t-shirt and you can order sticks as well now if you wait for the angry bird which is more expensive but it also means that you're not going to get a t-shirt and you we won't be able to sell you any sticks at that point so register as soon as possible. And we only have 30 spots, guys. So once those spots are gone, it's gone forever. Until then, my name is Guru Francis, Big Boy Screamador. Peace out, God bless, and keep swinging them sticks.